Hi guys, and welcome to the vlog. That's right. After about a seven month break from doing vlogging on the channel, I've decided to add it back in. And the main reason for this is because I actually really missed it. So I thought it's about time I added it back on the channel. I mean, if you're not enjoying what you're doing that much, then why do it? The whole plan for today was to head up to the Peak District and in particular to go to Padley Gorge. But unfortunately, we've had about five or six days of complete downpour where it's been raining non-stop. So I imagine that it would be treacherous conditions uh, walking around the rocks and the kind of moss and stuff that you get over there. Now, I was really excited about going there, so it's a shame, but I'm gonna actually postpone that till next week. But I've decided that rather than just, you know, not going out today, I'm actually going to still do a vlog. But I don't have any plans for today's vlog, so this might just, it might be rubbish, I don't know, uh, or it might turn out being good. So we're gonna see what happens. Um, but at the moment, we've decided that we're gonna go and have a look at some local areas and uh, hopefully we can find some nice photos in these positions. Unfortunately though, the, uh, the weather has been bad like I've mentioned, so this might mean that I'm not gonna have the best look with the photos that I take. But as long as I'm enjoying myself, that's the main thing. And that was the whole reason I brought the vlog back onto the channel anyway, so that I could just go out and enjoy visiting these locations. So that's it. So we're gonna head out now. We're gonna drive around some local areas and hopefully, fingers crossed, we can find some nice places to stop off and take some photos. I set up the camera as I expected the rain came so I've left my camera out there protected of course I didn't fancy damaging it um, and I have found the first composition which is not particularly amazing in any kind of way but it's the first photo that I'm gonna get down for today's vlog and I think maybe turning it monochrome because it's very flat conditions might improve it so we'll have to see how it goes but at the moment I'm gonna wait for this rain to pass and then I can get out and take the photo. Oh, did I say I've actually got company today? There oh, we yeah. go. My dad's with me today and we always have fun when my dad comes along. As long as you feed him about every two hours, he's a happy man. And drinking. And drinking. <laughs> so my dad's come out to do a bit of photography as well today. Um, well, well yeah, we're just waiting for this rain to go and then we can crack on take some photos. Okay, so this is gonna be the quickest piece to camera ever. So I've set up this composition it keeps raining, so we've been in and out the car, and every time that I try and set it up, it rains. So what I've done is I've set up a composition here for this plant in the foreground, which I'm hoping you can see from the camera. You've got in the mid-ground the tree, and in the right far distance, you've got this really nice church. There's lots of cars which keep going past all the time, and I'm hoping they're not gonna blur out the image in the distance. Now, I'm in manual mode. I've got it set up at ISO 200 and I'm set at an aperture of, oh, let's have a look, f11. And also my shutter speed is 160. But I've got it on the tripod, so it should be fine, no shake there. So I'm gonna go ahead, take this picture quick, before it carries on raining. composition. 
position. Well, first photo in the back. Not really over the moon with it, but it's a photo all the same. And I'm happy I've managed to capture one. I might have to turn it into a monochrome finish in Lightroom perhaps, because the light was really flat. So we're actually heading now to try and find somewhere else, just driving around, uh, kind of aimlessly really, um, just trying to get somewhere that actually we can take another picture, and have a bit of fun doing it. Now I will apologize at this point of the video if the audio hasn't been very good. And that's because I'm actually using the Osmo Pocket. But I bought this digital recorder because I know the audio on the Osmo Pocket's not really that good. But unfortunately, the audio on this is even worse. It's, it's not working, and when it does work in, when it does work, it's crackling. So unfortunately, the audio has been pretty bad. So let's leave that, and we're going to have to carry on going with the Osmo Pocket. So apologies in advance. The audio is not very good. Anyway, we're going to carry on driving around, enjoying the day, and hopefully we find something else to take a picture of. So we've stopped off again and as you can see I'm standing next to some wheat, barley or whatever it is and it's as tall as me. It's not difficult is it because I'm tiny but just in the distance over there there are some trees which are scattered around and I think that potentially that would make a really nice lone tree shot and then this could be the foreground which is the wheat here. I think it could work. Once again, the light's quite flat, but the clouds in the distance behind the tree have actually got the most um, character, let's say. So hopefully I can get a shot here before it starts raining. So I'm gonna head back to the car and get the camera. Okay, so I've got a few trees here in front of me, like I just said, but I think I'm gonna go for the one which is on the far left over here because it's got the most interesting background the sky where the clouds are are actually quite nice at the moment. There's a bit of separation. And um, this wheat in the foreground here might end up being a really nice looking foreground. I might even do it with, um, I might blur out the actual foreground here and use depth of field to make that kind of smoothed out so that your attention is all on the tree and the distance. I'm also gonna shoot it handheld. Now, I usually use a tripod but I actually think it's a little bit difficult setting it up here. And the way I'm shooting it, I actually don't need a tripod. So I'm gonna go ahead, take this photo now, and hopefully it comes out as good as I want it to. Today's video seems to be all about trees and lone trees, but uh, that wasn't intended. But it looks like it could make a great photo. I'm just hoping we've got the same conditions that we had yesterday and it wasn't completely flooded. But before we go there, it's really important that I get some food in my dad because it's it's been over the two hour mark and uh, he's gonna start getting hungry. And I don't want that happening while I'm in the car sitting next to him. So we're gonna head off, get some food, and then we're gonna I'll head up. Eat you. I don't doubt that. I think he has cannibalistic tendencies. So we're going to head down, get some food, and then we're going to check out this last place and hopefully there's one more photo to be had.
Well, do you know what? That was actually really enjoyable. So the weather conditions haven't been perfect. It's been raining most of the time, but it's been so good to get out and just do a vlog and take some photos. Just be out with nature. Sometimes it's really nice to just unplug from all the noise that we get around us these days and just, just relax. And I think I've been able to do that today. And that's exactly the reason I started the vlog up again. So I could just really, just enjoy it. Because we spend a lot of our time sleeping and the rest of our time, we're doing a job which most of us, if we're honest, we're not particularly enjoying. So it's great to get out and just enjoy something with the time that we have. So I've really enjoyed today and I'm really hoping that last photo that you just saw me take turns out well because through the viewfinder and the histogram and everything else that was going on, it looked like it could be a really nice shot. But you just never know until you get back on the computer and then you really have a proper look at it. Anyway guys, I want to say a big thank you to everyone who's tuned in today and watched this first vlog uh, in all this time. And yeah, thanks for watching the video. And if you haven't already and this is your first time here, hit subscribe and then look out for more tutorials, more vlogs and more reviews coming soon.